Hey, how's it going? Today is Artifact Day. So we're back over here on the Community Cluster. I'm wanting to do some boss fights soon. Been working on a lot of breeding to get some special tames going that I have never used before. But one of the main things I'm missing is the artifacts. So what we're going to do, we're going to head over to one of the caves we've been into before on our single player. But everything's different on these servers. Stuff's a lot harder. We're going for a double artifact today. The coordinates for this one is roughly around 2157. That's kind of over in the middle of the map. Kind of see up top there, around 2157, there's the double artifact cave, there's also the valley with the castle and stuff. That's the one we're going for. Super unfriendly, man, it's gonna be hot, there's lava in there. And what you can do is fly in on your bats and get stuff that way. We're not doing it, that is way too easy. However, before we get started, let me show you something. In the last video, we started doing some of the decorating around base with the Eco's garden decor. One of the problems I was having was putting this out. I did not realize this is a gate. So that's why we'll never clip anything. All you have to do is find one of the actual gate frames. Set that down. And then your gate actually clips to it. I was trying to set that up as a fence by itself. It doesn't exactly work like that, but clip it to one of the fences and it does work. Just wanted to show you after I realized, you know, it was brought to my attention that I was trying to take a gate and put it up on a fence foundation. <laughs> I gotta see why it wouldn't work. But anyways, let's leave these in here. We'll deal with some more of this later, man. There's a lot of stuff I still want to build. I've got a very, very good idea for expanding out here. That's what I was talking about doing. I usually do all my, well, as you can kind of see, right? We got the teams raising up over here. I've got an idea out there with some of the foundations and some fountains and stuff like that. But that is for a different video. Let's grab a couple things. I think I've already got the dragon on me. That's what we're flying over on. And here's the thing. I talked about not wanting to use the bat. You can use the bat to fly in and grab stuff. However, I like using the ravagers in there. Now, our Ravager does not do very much damage. That is fine. We're going to take him. I think we got some stuff for some zipline anchors. We might actually have some of those already made. And apparently we do not. We might just use regular grapples in. I don't know if I have stuff for zipline anchors. I got to unlock it first. It is unlocked. Oh, that's made in the smithy. That's why. The main thing I would be missing is, I think it uses fungal wood, right? It does. Can we do 10? Oh, we can. Nice. So we'll go ahead and use this. Oh, we can't. We've only got... What was that? Seven? We got five. We're probably missing the... Oh, we're just missing fiber. Well, fiber's not an issue. Let's, uh, let's grab our sickle. Actually, you know what? Five should be fine. We're just going across the lava on the Ravager. We'll break those whenever we leave. I don't want them strung all up everywhere. Nobody uses them but me. I just don't like using the bat going in. So, let's grab our crossbow. The bat makes stuff way too easy. And I like it to be a little bit of a challenge still. What are we looking for? Gear. I changed all my stuff up recently, so all the folder names are a lot different. There's our crossbow. Let's load that up. We'll put you down here. We'll put you in there. And you over there. If we need more than five, we'll have some problems. We got wingman with us, so we should be fine. Should be. Hear that, Junior? Hopefully, I'll tell you what, we need to grab you a helmet. We need to grab you a helmet. There's a lot of bats in there. Need your little head protected. I'm just saying. We've got this one. There's another one that the other wingman has been using. I don't see it. It's a riot one. Maybe I accidentally threw it into the grinder. It's fine. It's fine. We'll give you this one, buddy. There we go. <laughs> Protect your little head, man. Please do not die. The people in the comments will never let me forget about it. I'm just saying, it happens. We do have some medical brew. We are not taking that many. We're going to take some, though. Probably take about 200 or so. Let's grab a little bit more. Just because there is bats in there, and I do not want to get rabies. Actually, I tell you what. Something we never do. Let's go ahead, change stuff up. We are taking some antidotes. <laughs> Again, it never happens, but it'll be fine. We'll put those down there. We've got hot water. We need to change this to cold. Almost totally forgot about that. It would have been horrible. We definitely would have been in a bad spot trying to heal up with that. We've got enough of the beef jerky and stuff, too. So we got food. We got water, medical brew, antidote. We've got the Ravager, right? We do. Dragon for getting over there. Maybe we'll take the bat just in case. Like I said, I don't want to use it. However, I do not want to get over there and not be able to get it, actually. I think the bat's up top there. And one other thing I want to take is the mining drill. And that should be plenty of gas. We'll use that whenever we get in there, just for grabbing some of the the element shards. I think there's some in that cave. I don't know. I never really paid attention. 
Junior, you want to go on an adventure? Not saying we're going to use you, but it'll be nice to have you around. Let's go ahead and pick you up. Now, I'm not exactly sure which one of the teleporters gets closest over there. So we'll, uh, we'll see when we get there. And then whenever we get back, I'm kind of worried about it being daytime and nighttime. We'll talk about what teams we got going on, and I'll show you the ones that I'm going to be using for the boss fights. It's some of the Tarbo Rex, and I kind of had a good breeding line set, and then I tamed another one that had better health and better damage. So the whole breeding line got reset. Let's go to, I think, south. Southwest. That should put us somewhat over there. Are we good? Away from everybody? Probably should have grabbed some water while I was there. It's fine. It's fine. We'll fill up. That'll be plenty for the trip, I hope. And we should have enough shotgun shells. Oh, uh, dude, I am so nervous about going into this cave. It's so easy to die in there. We good? We all right? Nothing attacking us? It's always a good thing. We got somebody else set up over here. Take a look and see who it is. We got quite a few more new people on the servers. I think we're up to around 60 now. Oh, yep. One of our new people. Nice, man. Nice. At least they got some protection set up around base. It's, uh, it's kind of dangerous over here because of all the Dinotheriums, man. We toned the spawns down. There is still a ton of them. Well, right there. Just talking about them. They are not friendly. Holy crap, are they not friendly. So how far away are we? Not too far. Let's get up here. We'll go over the cliff, down in the valley, and that will be our destination. It's been quite a while since I've been in this cave. Uh, dude, I am nervous. There are micro raptors around here. We definitely got to watch out for those. Those and the ants. Let's go ahead and set the ants on fire. A little bit of a barbecue. Uh-huh. We good? Nobody else? There are some snow owls around here, too. Cost problems in the past. Hopefully not today. All right, so we're good there. Like I said, the coordinates for this cave are roughly 2157, and that'll put you right here. Again, for reference, down there is the valley. Over there is the other side where we spawned in at, and right over there is like the Helm's Deep Castle, so kind of put you right here. So what I plan on doing as we're getting here, we are not trying to jump across all this. We're going to shoot a zip line all the way across. As far as we can. We'll attach it right here. Please, buddy, jump onto the zip line and not into the lava. I would appreciate it. And then the next one, we should be able to shoot all, almost all the way across over there. If we can get our, our aim down on it. Wrong one. There we go. I think it's like right over there. I think. We'll cross our line so we can easily jump across to it. Nice, man. Nice. I usually like to attach it over here. I couldn't see it because of the flames. This is, uh, this part is kind of sketchy, man. Make sure he jumps across and not into the lava. Ah, oh, dude, I tell you what. Nice, man. Nice. Oh, right there. Right there. Easy. Easy. Back it up a little bit. Sometimes he doesn't jump straight down like that. He'll actually jump forward and lunge. And dude, I tell you what, man, it's <laughs> it's nerve-wracking. So there is a huge gap down there. I'm gonna shoot one more zip line. That's where it gets kind of dangerous, man. We got all the bats and everything in there. And we'll do this one to right here. And that'll get us across the next two gaps. And then all we have to do, all that we have to do, is uh fight off the bats. And make sure we get our artifacts. One's going to be up here to the left. One's going to be to the right. There are some loot crates in here, too. So I'm kind of excited about getting those. Oh, dude, it doesn't go all the way across. Man. Oh, there we go. I didn't know if he was going to be able to jump. Oh, I forgot about the centipedes. Please do not break my armor. Okay, we got the bats. We do have some of the antidotes, so I'm not too worried. The main thing is the, the centipedes, right? Yep, 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 yep. Oh, do not jump into lava. Dude, come on, man. I hate trying to do stuff in first person. It just doesn't work out. Now we got all the bats here. Okay, tell you what. Tell you what. He's not a fighter, man. He does 44 on his damage. I probably should have brought a team that has a little bit more on damage. I planned on using the shotgun, which, I mean, I guess we have to now, right? Yep, yep, yep. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Look, mistakes were made, okay? I probably should have brought the Thylan. It's the last time I'm coming here with a Ravager alone. It's so hard to hit stuff up close with the server, right? Because sometimes the shots don't register. That's all I'm going to blame it on. Not my aim has absolutely nothing to do with my aim, man. It is fully the server every time. That's the way it goes. <laughs> oh, dude, at least they're not too high level. Around 200 on the levels on these guys. It's all right. As soon as we start getting rid of some, we'll be fine. We haven't got rabies yet either. Kind of surprised. The thing is, we brought the antidote. 
So what that means is we'll never get rabies because we have it with us. Ravager's taking a lot of damage, man. Oh, the Ravager's taking a lot of damage. There we go. See, we're only hitting him with like one or two pellets, which is kind of not good for us, right? Yep. Yep, 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 yep. You're fine, buddy. You're fine. You're fine. It's going to sting a little bit, man. It's going to sting a little bit. There we go. 144 gone. Okay. Okay. We've got to figure out how to get out of here. I can probably use Wingman if we have to. We have one more. Got two more. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, the reload, man! Our Ravager's almost dead. It's fine, it's fine! Okay, okay, we'll get on the bat if we have to, to get out of here. Our bat, not these bats. Right in the lava, Junior! Get out of the lava! Get out of the lava! If it's not the bats, it's the lava! Yep, reload, reload. Always reloading. Come on, dude. Come on. You act like we haven't been in an artifact cave in a while. Well, I mean, we haven't really. Not on this map. The bats, dude! Please just die! I'm shooting them! It's not registering! Re -re reload, reload. Yep, reload, reload. Reload right the lava, Junior! <gasps> oh, that's not gonna work! Okay, look, look. Might have made a mistake here, okay? We got Wingman, it's fine, it's fine. We don't need no Ravager! Junior! Told you about the lava, buddy! Okay, we're fine, we'll get the saddle. They are expensive. Look, man, look, okay? Fully my fault on that part, okay? <laughs> Luckily, he was an extra Ravager. I'm just saying, we have a nice breeding line that's made for fighting. I probably should have brought one of those instead. So the problem is we didn't bring any bug spray. I probably should have brought some bug spray. I don't know if we're going to be able to grab any of the uh, the element charge, right? This is kind of, it feels like cheating using wingman. Buddy, do not fail us now. Please do not fail us now. It's going to be a very bad video if you do. Where we're going to is right up over here in the middle. That's going to be the first one. We're going to swoop in. We're gonna grab it, and we're gonna jump out! Buddy! Oh, Junior! Do not get webbed! Please do not get webbed, dude! Fine. We're fine. We're fine. We got one artifact. We'll be alright. If I lose Wingman 8, I will never hear the end of it! There's a penguin! Can't stand the penguins, man. Oh, there's another one. That's right. I forgot. Should've brought... Well, couldn't bring the otter because we have Wingman on us. Is there any... Where are the element shards at? I've never really... Got those in here. They might be out in that main part of the cave up there. Down off on the sides. Oh, there's one up there. Oh, I'll tell you what. We're going to do this. Flap your wings, buddy. Flap your wings! I hear you! I don't know what that was. I don't think it was worth it. It's okay. Okay. We're, fi oh, we're fine. Dude, do not drop us. Look, Junior. That's a lot of bats. That is a lot of bats in here. Holy crap, dude. If I would have had some bug spray, probably would have been a little bit better. Just saying. I think down there is where the... is where the uh, crystals are for us to bust. The red ones to get the shards from. Let's grab this loot drop. I haven't done any loot drop runs in forever, man. Glide to safety! Glide, dude! You're falling! Is it centipede? It's alright. <laughs> Dude. Oh, man. This one, we're gonna stay up high. We need to check down here, too, for some of the loot crates and stuff down towards the lava. Or is that all lava? Alright. Down a little bit. Easy. Good speed. All we gotta do is make it over this. We'll be fine. Well, I mean, we're not gonna be fine. We'll be okay, right? There's another loot crate over there. All right, we should have enough time to get the artifact. Get the artifact. Get the artifact. Okay, we're good. We're good. Move, buddy. Move. Get out of the way. Oh, there's a rune. I need those, man. I think I'm at like 108 or so. We'll, we'll check when we're in a little bit better uh, position than we are now. Okay, we got a stone hatchet I saw. Fantastic. I like it. Totally worth it. We're getting the rune, man. We're getting the rune. We're in here. I don't know if we're ever coming back. I hear them all. I am not turning around to see what's back there. Junior's doing good on his stamina. I don't see any loot crates down there. There is a ramp going down, which kind of has me wondering. 
Cinema Crafts makes it all easy. I know, I know I have the bat. Don't yell at me. I don't want to use it. Of course, if we have to come back for a rescue mission, <laughs> we're definitely going to be using the bat. All right, let's double check in this part of the cave. This is kind of towards the exit, right? Maybe on the other side. Oh, it's not. I was thinking this is one more chamber up. Still, though, there's nothing in here. Do we have all those bats on us? Oh, there's a whole bunch of them. Dude, look at all the bats, man. Oh, they kind of lost aggro. It's nice. Let's swoop down a little bit. And let's try to not get aggro in here as long as we can. So over here is where the Ravager died. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. Please do not hit me, please. There's a loot crate over there. We'll grab that one. It's kind of hard to see far down. I don't think there's any crystals down there. Oh, there's a rune, too. We need to grab that. If we haven't already! Oh, there's a... a nice, uh, fur helmet in there. Okay. 108 of 200. I like it. I like it. Let's get up over here. Excuse me, pardon me. Coming through. Passing by. Oh, there's another loot crate! There's also a centipede and a bat. Okay, okay. We're gonna swoop in, grab it, and get out. Oh, we killed it. Oh, that is nice! Every pellet hit. Doesn't always happen. I don't see anything in here for element shards. I thought there were supposed to be some in here. Check over this way. Unless I just can't see because it's dark. I mean, we could turn the lights up. <laughs> Didn't think about that. Anyways, let's get out of here, man. We got a good bit of loot. I want to see what we have. We need to get back to base. Get our artifacts set out. And then we'll show you the Tarbo Ricks that we have kind of set up. Not too bad of a cave run. I mean, we lost the Ravager, which kind of sucks. Let's, um, we'll get up here, we'll break our zip lines. I don't want to leave those in case, uh, they get in the way of somebody else, you know? Seems like there are multiple people on the server. Can I, can I access you? There we go. I hear you. I'll tell you what, we'll break it over here. Junior! Please, man! We are not going for a lava bath today, if we can help it. We can break both of these at once. That will be great. Oh, there we go. Okay, we're gone. We're gone! <laughs> oh, dude, it's always an experience whenever you go into a lava cave. Just saying. I mean, that's worse than these snow ones. Speaking of the snow ones, we also have that one to do here soon, too. So that's coming up here fairly quick. Let's get on the dragon. Loading lag from leaving the cave. Okay, okay, okay. I like it. Do we have bats coming? We don't. Right, let's get on this guy. Hello? Am I too close to the cave? I think I'm too close to the cave. There we go. Yeah, too close to it. Cool, let's get up in the air here. We'll take a look at our loot. See what we got. So we have the two artifacts. Very nice. We've got some of the apprentice cloth. I don't want that. Too low level. Same with the pants. We've got a saddle for a healing pig. Well, hold on to that. I don't know if we've got a better one. We've got a dire bear saddle. We've got a dire bear. Oh, okay. We got the blueprint too. It's probably going to be cheaper than this. We'll probably grind that one. We've got a nice set of fur hat. I don't think I have one of these yet. So we'll definitely keep that made into a blueprint. We've got a pick. We'll grind. We've got a better one of these back at base. We've got a saddle for a patchy. I like them, man. They're, they're fun little teams, right? And then we got a ravager. Oh, wait, that's... <laughs> that's our ravager saddle. And then we've got a whole journeyman stone hatchet. We are not keeping that. So the loot was kind of a bust on that. It's fun, though, man. It's fun to grab them. Let's get back to base, and we'll set out our artifacts and look at our wrecks. I'm probably just gonna... Let's land over here. Hey, what is this? Is this a cave? What is this? Oh, that village is up there. This is a little... Okay, never mind. Never mind. I know where we're at. Don't worry about that. We're going to Verdeland south and east. And that'll put us right back at our base. A little bit of water and food. Just saying. A little bit of breakfast. Nice, man. Nice. All right. Top on to Junior. Short little flight up to base. I like it, man. I did quite a bit of fishing out here in the water, trying to get some alpha kills for my chibi. I tell you what, man, normally, whenever you get in the water for anything, dude, there are tons of sharks, a bunch of alphas, alpha leads, you can't go anywhere. However, whenever I was out there hunting them, 
I saw over the whole ocean. I did the whole thing, man, the whole map. I got two alpha megs, and and that was it. <laughs> Maybe 18 sharks altogether was in the water. Not too sure why. Kind of weird, but it happens, man. It happens. It's the way it goes with Ark, man. Anytime you want something, you'll never see it. So, we're going to need two of the artifact pedestals. And then let's throw some stuff into the grinder. We're going to hold on to that. I need to double check. We're going to get rid of you. And you, we need to hold on to you. We don't have any for the dire bears. So we're keeping this one. And we got a better one of those. It's, I tell you what we're going to do is we're going to make this into a blueprint because that is going to be super cheap compared to this one. And it's almost the same armor rating. Let's go ahead and grab some paints. It's always nice to paint it beforehand, then whenever you make one, it comes out automatically painted. Fantastic feature, man, I'm just saying. Is this the converting table, or the... That's a blueprint one. Haven't used it in a while, man. So you're a blueprint. And let's double check on our fur cap, too. I don't think we have one. We got pants. Okay, cool. So let's go ahead and paint that. Well, I don't want to paint that because I changed the colors on them. So we'll leave that normal. Again, it's a journeyman one, so it's going to be super cheap to make. All that we have on that is 500 on the the pelt hair or fur or wool. We've got a ton of wool from the sheep. 89 on the metal ingots. <laughs> super cheap. 62 on the hide, and then 26 on the fiber. And that comes out with almost 400 durability, so it'll definitely last a good bit of time. Let's drop our saddle off in here, though. Our poor Ravager, man. I'll show you our Ravagers, too, that we have that we're kind of getting raised up. And there's some people on the server that got better ones, so I'll probably change my lineup later on, but for right now, the ones that I have are going to definitely be good for what I'm doing. I'm wanting to use them in boss fights here soon, too, so I definitely need to get some more breeding going on with them. They're not, a, they're not perfect stats. So for the boss Tarbos, there's none in there. Can't show you those. We've got the Shadow Mains. We'll be doing some boss fights with these guys. The stats on them are 42 on the health, and then we've got 40 on the damage. Not bad at all, man. Fantastic colors, dude. Oh, the colors are so nice. We've got our Giga line that we've been working on. Those come out with 36 on the health and then 49 on damage. Very, very good. We'll be doing some world boss tours with them soon. I need to get some more of the relics and stuff together. And then the Tech Rexes. I'm working on these guys, too. I want to try these on some of the boss fights. They have 55 in the damage and 48 in the health. So they're definitely boss ready. I just got to get some good saddles, man. I've only got an 81 armor saddle that I'm using for them. My Ravagers are 43 on health and only 34 on damage, so it's not too bad, but they got 40 into weight, and they've got that blue-white kind of kind of color to them, and kind of gray on their body, so, I mean, they look fantastic, man. Very, very nice. And here's my Tarbos. They've got 49 on health and 41 on damage. Now, the thing about these guys is, we've got the high health, we've got decent damage, however, my saddle for these... Is a 365 so that just means we don't have to put as much points into health especially with their already high stat on that so we can put a ton of points into damage i really really want to test these guys on some boss fights so it's it's gonna be interesting man it's gonna be interesting let's get these set up so we've got one place here and let's do this one in there, and then I want to start setting some of these, I think, by the transmitter here. I want to go up to the cold area. I mean, I hate that one because it has a lot of Perlovia in it, but it's kind of a fun cave, and there's some good loot drops in there, so we might be doing that one maybe in the next video. Like I said, I want to get as many of the artifacts as we can, and then get the boss fights going. And then there's one more cave that I'm kind of nervous about. It's a puzzle cave, man. It's over under the blue obelisk. Uh, dude, that is not a safe one, man. But not too bad of a day. We had some issues getting in there. Uh, like I said, I know we can use a bat to fly through the caves. That seems super broken, especially for artifacts. They should be a challenge, man. We lost a tame today. Kind of my fault. I'll admit we were having some problems with the bats. But if we were flying with the bat, then there would be no challenge, right? It'd be fly in, grab them fly right back out so it's, it's fun man it's fun it's fun you're supposed to lose teams every now and then however we are gonna go ahead and leave this one here hope you enjoyed the video hope you liked our short little artifact run today as always thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one